As we near 10 years since Hurricane Katrina hit, New Orleans leaders and Houston leaders are coming together to mark the anniversary. Tonight, a special service is being held at New Home Ministries. The church was established after Katrina with displaced residents from Louisiana. And joining us this morning is the head of the congregation, Bishop R.C. Blakes, Jr. Good morning and thanks for being here. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Okay, now, you have a special guest that's supposed to be coming in all the way from New Orleans. Yes, Tell us sir. about it and why is he coming to our area? Uh, the Honorable Mayor Mitch Landrew is coming to uh, New Home Family Worship Center tonight, and he's coming to celebrate a decade of survival. Uh, as you know, this church, as you mentioned, was founded mm -hmm. after Katrina with residents that were formerly from New Orleans. So he's coming tonight to just celebrate 10 years, which is hard to believe, of survival and resilience. Houston played such a major role wow. after Hurricane Katrina. Have, have many people thought about going back or, or is this home for them now? And why have they chosen to stay here? Many went back obviously, but many stayed. And um, the reason uh, they stayed is because there was such compassion. I think it was Mayor White at the time. There was such a, an outreach of love. And uh, it just, Houston provided a safe haven at a time when people really were at their wit's end. Now, are some of those residents who are here who call Houston home now still traveling back? Sort of, sort of dual citizen, so mm -hmm. to speak. That's exact. Well, I'm one of those. I, I think we, we feel like there's a dual citizenship, uh, and many of them travel back and forth. On Sunday mornings, if something is going on in New Orleans, I can see it numerically because much, <laughs> of, the yes, much of the <laughs> congregation makes their way back to New Orleans. So it's a, it's a unique relationship now. And your church was formed right after Katrina uh, with your help and you, you now have hundreds of, of, of people. Tell us more uh, about the church and, and the strength of it. Well, the church is a, a sister church to six very strong congregations out of Louisiana. This is the only congregation that we have currently in Texas. And uh, it's a family-oriented environment that uh, we preach a positive uh, message of success and it's just an environment where you, you find people who have a mindset of survival mm -hmm. and not only survival but thriving through whatever conditions life might throw at you. Mm -hmm. Just a beautiful place to, to worship. Well, Bishop, we want to thank you for joining us here and letting us know what's going on and about this visitor that's coming in. And the service is tonight at 7. Give us a location real quick. 4805 Shermeyer Road. And we're also going to have the famous Kermit Ruffins, uh, the, the trumpeter, world famous trumpeter. He's going to be with us tonight playing some of that uh, New Orleans type uh, jazz music. Oh. You're going to have a second line. Yes. Church, huh? I, love that. <laughs> I could listen to that all, all right. day. What's you know about a second line? <laughs> hey, I, He knows a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Bishop, for being Thank here. Thank you for having and me. And enjoy yes. this evening. You yes. said that's a celebration. It's a celebration. A celebration of survival. The inspiring time. Thanks, Bishop.